Hello, people. How y'all doing at this moment in time? Just wanted to come on at this moment in time and talk to y'all for a little bit and uh, uh, give y'all some little info. But um, let's get off into it. Thank you, Father God, <coughs> for blessing us, I mean, for blessing us to see a see a new day. Watch over us and guide us and God us protect us throughout this day. Lead us throughout this day, Father God, and show us the way. And I pray, Father God, that you come through me at this moment in time in order to give the people absolute truth. And I pray, Father God, that you let the Holy Spirit come through me at this moment in time in order to give the people absolute truth. And I thank you for this to my prayer, Father God. Amen. Now what I want you to know is uh <coughs> Wish I ain't trying to miss me, but uh, uh, what I want y'all to know is uh, what's going on at this moment in time, and what's happening at this moment in time. Um, things are really, really kind of like speeding up at this moment in time. And the reason why they're speeding up is because the Lord Jesus Christ is coming. Okay. Um, But not only that, that he's turning the tables upon some things, and he's showing the Lord, he's showing some things, uh, 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 um, whatever um, it may seem like what's going on at this moment in time, but he's showing some things, you know, and uh, he's going to um, do some things beyond this world. And when he does these things, you're gonna see it, okay? But uh, what I want you to know is uh, they keep trying to miss, well, they was, they keep trying to miss with people, right? But what's gonna happen is uh, he's gonna send um, these enemies, <clears throat> well, he sent these enemies amongst each other. So, uh, everything that they have been doing to try and uh, hold the people, the people are going to keep going forward, and the people are going to keep moving forward into what they need to move into for, forward into what they need to do, which is God's wills and God, God's purpose for their lives, right? That's what these enemies have been trying to stop because the people, they have been plugged in into these people's energy, into these people's, until these people are uh, 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 power and energy. When they speak of power and thing, like I made the, the, the video uh, yesterday, last night, and I was telling you how the the the, the, the planet get its uh, energies and how the planet get its uh, 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 power source. This is why you hear them say, "Oh, they 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 hungry for power." This is what it's about. And I bring up, bind it up, and I cast it down. But listen. These things that's going on is uh, they use these things and they do these things. I'm people buying you up in the cash now. They do these things to hook the people to the planet, which I know about, which I rebuke or bind it up and I cast it down. They have been doing these things for a long time. This is how wicked they are. This is how people don't know even know what type of games they play. You understand? So I'm gonna show you something. This game is over. The Lord told them not to mess with something that they ain't had no business to put their hands on. And I know they listen to my videos, but I'm here to tell you, you ain't had no business putting your hands on. And they messed up real bad, real bad, to the point where he's gonna, he's gonna bring them down in their, their systems down. You understand? And I prophesy, I declare it under and on the sound of my voice, I command it. He's gonna bring judgment upon them, the wrath of God upon them, fire from heaven upon them, and come. They got all in and one. They kept telling him, stop. Don't do this. I know he did. Don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do that. Don't do this. Leave him alone. Don't do this. You better not mess with that. 
if you mess with that, I'm coming. And I told you, when I tell you something, that the Lord would not let his word fall to the ground. That he would not let his promises go to waste of what that enemy tried to do. See, the thing is, he let the enemy do, he let the enemy have his leeway in so many ways, but he got a chain on that enemy. You understand? He has a chain to that dog. You hear me? So I'm going to tell you something. That dog tried to tell him what he wasn't going to do. So what's going to happen to the dog is, you know what's going to happen. But, what's happening is, uh, he told them not to mess with a specific thing and a specific person. He, know, he told them not to mess with a lot of specific people. And specific things to those people. You understand? You know what's gonna happen. He's bringing judgment, calm, uh, the wrath of God, and fire from him. I don't know if everybody else heard it, but I heard that he was angry. The Lord is not playing at this moment of time. He, he crossed the line this time. He, he really, he really crossed the line. You know, and um, man, he really crossed the line this time. Cause I'm gonna tell you something. The Lord don't play by his glory. You can play by your, I don't care what you're talking about. About that, you messing with that person, that, 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 all right there. But when you messing with a person and the person's supposed to have been doing something for the Lord and, and he messed with that thing, whatever it is, if the Lord made something, the Lord did something to do something that was going to bring him glory, you better not mess with the Lord's glory on oh, how serious he take that glory. You don't know, dude. Oh, he take that glory so serious. Y'all don't understand. <laughs> The glory. Yeah. They messed up. So this is what's gonna happen. Those enemies are gonna fight amongst themselves. When I'm trying to come up against the people or come up against the Lord, they're gonna have to they're gonna be fighting amongst themselves. And I prophesied the clad not creating on the sign, my voice I command it. They're going to fight amongst themselves because the things that they did, they're not going to know what's going to hit them. Even those ones that's trying to control it, they're going to fight amongst themselves because they're not going to know what's happening. It's going to go all out of frame. And when they plan some things go all out of frame, they're not going to see what's going to happen. He's going to tear them down. As he told them not to do it. And when he tell you something not to do it, which is the Lord is in control of all things, you're going to see it. You're going to know, like, yeah, they shouldn't have did that. <laughs> you're going to know then. Because, see, I told you, every few years the Lord has to show himself. Every few thousands of years, the Lord has to show these enemies who he is. And I mean physically. <laughs> physically. And when they see him, and when they see it, they know it. Oh my goodness. Let's go. It's already spoken in the word. Bring the rocks down on us. Let hide us from him. He already spoke it. Because he already know what's about to take place. The Lord is 40 billion years ahead of time. He, he starts from the, the ending all the way to the beginning. You understand? There's nothing 
that the, that can stop his plan or his prophecies or anything of anything that he's trying to do in his planet or in the universe or nothing because it's already written it's already wrote it's already made it's already uh predestined nothing can change i don't care how much this enemy try to work around things do this do that take things out right? now it ain't gonna work what's gonna happen is everything he's doing is just gonna fall right in line of what the lord wanted to do Now I pray and I prophesy out of glad and I'm and on the sound of my voice I command. It's gonna fall right in line. Right what the Lord wanted to do. Like I told you, he's 40 billion years ahead of time. You understand? But those enemies will fight amongst each other because they have no other choice. They're not gonna know what's gonna hit them like. They're gonna be shaking. And when they be shaking, they're gonna know that yeah, this is the Lord in the middle. He's about to do something. <laughs> he got no bidding. Man, what happened just then? That's right. And they're gonna be looking. Before they know it, they're gonna be looking at him right in the face. He's gonna be right there in their face. He's gonna put it down on them. I'm telling you. He's very strategic, very brilliant, and very strategic. So, I pray y'all take these messages to the Lord Jesus Christ at this moment in time. Get into uh, some fasting, some prayers, some reading your word, and uh, communion with the Lord. And um, this is God's good news for you today. Y'all be blessed. Amen.